what's going on guys it's your boy peter and i'm back again with another video today i'm here to share with you guys some few tips on how to pass your aircraft maintenance engineering cars exam for you guys who know one of the requirements to get your aircraft maintenance engineering license is to write and pass your cars exam and i'm here to share with you guys some few tips before I give you guys a tip, I'm going to talk about the requirements. So usually a course exam is a 50 question examination and you need at least 70% and above to pass your exam. So that means you need at least 35 and above to pass your course exam. So here's a few tips on how to pass your course exam. You would have to get this book called Cars for the AME. It's a book that looks exactly like this. And I always suggest to get the latest edition. So for the year 2023, the latest edition is edition nine, right here. So for next year, if you're doing your exam next year, you want to get edition 10. And that's because regulation get updated every year and you want to make sure you have the latest edition. So once you get this book, you would want to focus more on the test at the back. So you, this book usually comes with the five tests at the back. I would say personally, you want to study all the questions at the back and you want to make sure you're getting perfect in all the questions and that is because in your real examination they always you usually has the same question but in a different way so for example they can be like in this book they can be like you know what's the part for aircraft maintenance engineering license and rating which is part four or three but in your real examination they can be like part oh, part four or three is for what license and it's for what part is for what which is aircraft maintenance engineering license and rating so those are the, the just how the way they make they try to make those questions tricky in a different word so you want to make sure you study all the questions at the back and also understanding all the questions so once you already study all the questions at the back and you understand everything you want to also focus more on the parts and appendices and that's because almost 20 percent of the questions in your real exam is actually the part and appendices so once you know you already memorized the part and appendices you study all the questions on the back you get them perfect there's a website called pro profs which has at least six questions so once you study all the questions at the back you know you parse your appendix you want to go to that website called pro profs i'm going to drop the link in my description they have six questions you want six, six tests actually you want to study all those tests and you'll get in perfect in all of them and man that's all i did to be honest i only studied the book once and i did all the questions at the back i practiced and memorized all my parts and appendices and i also did those questions on that website and i was good for the examination and those are the three things i would say you need um my next video i'm gonna come up with the uh, study guide that you know the questions they mostly ask in the examination i'm gonna come up with the study guys to show to you guys so you guys can have an idea what kind of questions they usually ask right so yeah those are the few points on how to pass this uh course exam i try to make this video a little bit shorter i'm not trying to make no 20 minute video also yeah if you guys have any more questions let me know down in the comment section like i said i'm here to help you guys and for you guys that are watching and not subscribing man show your boy some love man you know what i'm saying show your boy some love subscribe and show your boy some love man so yeah those are the few points on how to pass this cars, cars exam and do not forget to like share and subscribe love you guys